I always knew that different was gonna be more rewarding and it'll just take me to the next level. And then I started doing the Liberty Spikes. And I remember I told myself, bro, I'll never forget this shit. I told myself, my hair will change my life. Do whatever the fuck you want. I know I said that, I keep repeating myself, but you guys don't understand. Let that shit sink in your head. Do whatever you want, bro. You're gonna fucking die one day, and then what? What? Do you wanna be in your deathbed and be like, what if I did? Don't ever be in your deathbed and be like, what if? Wh why? Like, bro, if you wanna quit your nine, to, your nine to five job, quit it. You will, if you really want the life you fucking fantasize about, you will literally, you will find ways to make money, bro. Look, bro, invest in Doge, invest in fucking SafeMoon. Bro, do, like, do that shit. If you don't wanna work, just, bro, just work, bro, dead ass. Every day, do something new. Literally, don't. And I don't want to stress this enough, but don't care about what anyone says about you, bro. You think when I walk the streets or when I go into a restaurant and fucking people see me like this, they're probably like, damn, that dude's on drugs. Or It doesn't matter, bro. You want to know why? Because they're talking about you. Good or bad, they are fucking talking about you and they will remember you. I can guarantee you, if I walk into somewhere, I am going to be the loudest one there. And I don't do it on purpose. It's literally just because I fucking want to do it. But... You guys have to understand that you can literally do whatever you want. You just have to, you just have to take the risk. And I realize that a lot of y'all want the clout without the risk. You guys just want fucking shit handed to each other. And it's not like that, bro. Like you got to work for your shit. So go out and fucking do what you do, bro. But do that shit different. Don't fucking duplicate yourself from someone else. Like you got to actually put your mind into shit. Dead ass. Like... That's it. That's all I gotta say. I'm about to end this fucking live, but... That's when Virgil reached out to me, and the first thing he told me was literally like, Yo, dude, I really like your look. Like, let me just send you clothes. And when he saw that video of me skating in those shoes, and he saw how everyone was so mad and commenting all this, he literally texted me like, This is it. This is your time. Let me start sending you more stuff. You skate in it. And um, that very moment is like when it all happened. I'll never forget those people that believed in me because they believed in me before I believed in myself. Everything happened because I skated. If I wouldn't have picked up a skateboard, none of this would have happened. My name is Burberry Airy. Whenever I hear that phrase, don't stop hopping fences, I just think of passion. It doesn't even have to be about skateboarding or any craft is like that. It's literally like, don't stop hopping fences. It's like, don't stop what you're doing. Whatever makes you happy, do that. You guys, two years ago, were literally telling me, this is mesh, by the way, this is mesh. Look at the fucking vamp shoulders. Two years ago, I'm not lying, two years ago, you guys were literally telling me, why are you wearing this? What, what, why, why? Two years, fast forward, right now, you guys are telling me why, but I realized that you guys changed the, de the definition in your why, meaning like, why are you selling this? Oh, oh, now that you guys understand what I'm like wearing, now you guys are like, oh yeah, like, bro, like I've been doing this shit, I'm dead ass, and I'm like, I'm not even, I'm, you know what, I'm not even a cocky person. I'm just here being like, wow, now you guys understand. Like, when I want to get rid of my shit, you guys are like, what, what, why? Why is, is it a scam? It's not a fucking scam. I don't like this anymore. Do you not realize what I'm wearing? Look at what I'm wearing. Head to fucking toe. Look, what I walk in, this is just my shoes at fucking home. Like, you guys, you guys, yeah. I'm not trying to get into that real quick, but. I just realized that you guys hate me so much for no fucking reason. It's literally insane. I don't even say one word to you guys. And you know what? I, I'd rather be that way because I realized that me being relevant is way better than you guys not knowing who I am. So you guys commenting or whatever the fuck, you guys are thinking about me. So I'd rather have you guys hate me than not know who I am. That's what I'm trying to say. So like telling myself like damn dude I literally wasted my life I wasted everything just because I wanted to skate and where am I little did I know that every single decision and just everything I did was worth it I forgot the rest but